my introduction to puberty was probably a little more extreme than most kids. My mom and dad never gave me the talk, and we didn't really have sex ed classes at school. So when my body started changing, I was actually horrified. Maybe it's best if I start from the beginning. Hi, my name is Heather, and my story starts a couple of years ago. It was a couple weeks after my 10th birthday, and nothing was out of the ordinary. I woke up, came downstairs, pushed my little brother's face in his cereal, you know, just your average Tuesday. I went to school and everything was great, right up until gym class. Now, normally I don't mind gym class. I love running. But today we had to do indoor circuit work. That meant the parallel bars, Olympic rings, pummel horse, and of course the rope of hell. It was bad enough I had to show off just how uncoordinated I was, but now you're going to watch me fail climbing a stupid rope just for the sake of it? When is rope climbing a skill that ever even comes in handy? I hate boats, and after seeing Squid Game, I'm never playing tug-of-war again. So, after a couple mediocre tumble turns and falling off the bars a few times, it was my turn to go up the rope from hell. It didn't help that the rest of my class had already finished the circuit, and they'd begun to form a crowd around my final obstacle. I took a deep breath and heaved myself up the rope. I was actually surprised. It wasn't as difficult as I thought it was going to be. Coiling the rope in my feet, I got a rhythm going, and it wasn't long before I'd reached the top. I couldn't believe it. I'd worked myself up for so long about this, and I'd nailed it first try. All my classmates down on the ground started loudly cheering, and for a second I felt pretty damn good about myself. Until I realized. They weren't cheering. They were laughing and pointing. I looked down and noticed a tiny red stain forming through my yellow gym shorts. What was happening? I screamed, and in a panic, I let go of the rope, falling backwards and down into the gym mats below. Everyone's laughs turned quiet as they realized I could be seriously hurt. Luckily, I'd landed flat on the gym mats and hadn't broken anything. My gym teacher had seen everything and rushed over before ushering everyone to the locker rooms to get changed. She helped me up, put her jacket around my waist, and walked me into the teacher's lounge bathroom. By this stage, my shock had turned to tears and I struggled to talk. Wh wh what's happening to me? I sobbed. It's okay, Heather. You can relax. You just got your period. My what? I said, your period, it's completely normal. It just means your body is getting ready to turn into a grown-up like me. But I'm bleeding! Yeah, that part sucks. It's gonna happen roughly once a month until you hit your 50s. Once a month? Yeah, but it's nothing to worry about. It's just the lining of your uterus building up and shedding off as your body cycles. It's perfectly natural. She put her arm around me and then fished through her handbag for a second before pulling out a single maxi pad. Here's what you're going to do. You can use the teacher's bathroom to clean up. I'll get your uniform collected so you can change back and pop this on the inside of your underwear to watch any extra leaks. That way, accidents like today won't happen again. I'll never forget my rude introduction to puberty. It's something that definitely took some time to live down. Have you ever had an embarrassing moment to do with puberty changes? What happened? Let me know in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like and subscribe for more videos about topics that matter most. Thanks for watching!